Hey guys, it's Cassie, your Monday on the Spicy Viola's channel. Um, this week's theme is story time, and so I thought, hey, why not start it off with a wonderful story about the time I first saw a penis. So, um, I was about 12 or 13, because it was in 7th grade, so middle school was when I first saw a penis. <laughs> um, it was from a kid that I had a crush on at the time. Uh, his name, well, I actually don't want to say his name. Uh, let's, let's say his name was Tom. So Tom and I were friends because we had physical education together. So we had PE together because at that time, 7th and 8th graders mixed and I was in 7th grade and he was a year older so he was in 8th grade. And, um, at that time, I had, I think it was when his best friend had a crush on me at that time, but I was, like, iffy on if I should, like, date him or not, because in middle school, I was like, I don't need a boyfriend. Who needs a boyfriend in middle school, to be honest? And then, so in my head, I was like, there's no point in dating anybody in middle school, because at the time, Tom had a girlfriend too. So let's just say that the guy I dated, I didn't, we didn't even really hold hands. We held hands like once and he like kissed me on the cheek and told everybody that he was my first kiss when he really wasn't because I never kissed him. Anyways, this is, this is a different story. Um, but let's call him Julio because why not? Um, so Julio and I had been like talking for a little bit and he was like interested in me so I was like okay whatever maybe I'll say yes to him and my friend convinced me to say yes to him because her boyfriend at the time was also friends with the guy that liked me so I said yes to him but like before I said yes Tom um and I had been texting because obviously we were friends and stuff and so we had been texting and we uh, were talking about, I think we were talking about who won like maybe badminton tournaments or something or like who had the best score because in middle school we had like different season, seasons to do, um, during our um, our year so like we'd play badminton we played tennis we did archery we did like a bunch of different stuff so uh, I probably was asking him something about that because I had a small crush on him so obviously anything we could talk about I wanted to talk about so like we could have a like communicate and stuff and so we were talking about something very casual very unsexual because I was like 12 I didn't even think about sex or anything at this time I didn't even know what a penis looked like I didn't really want to know what a penis looked like I never thought about what a penis would look like I had never thought about getting dick pics and stuff and then one this one day that we were talking um he sends me a dick pic and I'm just like what is this because at the time it was like just a photo and like obviously I didn't know what it was gonna be because I didn't tell him to send me one nor did I ever expect him to send me one because it, you know, like I didn't think about that at that time and so he sent me one and I open it and I'm just like bombarded it's like you know that that gif it's what I call it. I call them gifs or gifs gifs or gifs whatever um unlike tumblr where it's like oh when you open tumblr and it's just like a bunch of dicks in your face um that's what i felt like when i opened this message <laughs> because it was just like a dick in my face and i was like no 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 no! i do not want to see this this is gross that's disgusting why would you send this to me i'm like 12 i really was like 12 at the time too and then he was like oh you know you like seeing my nice penis or something like he said something about how his penis was like good looking and I was like no 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 it's not I was like no I did not want to see that why would you send that to me that's so appropriate Tom you have a girlfriend Tom your best friend Julio is like 
in love with me, like in love as you can be in love in middle school. Um, he has a crush on me, he wants to ask me out and you're like doing this to him? I was like, that's so inappropriate, this is not okay, why would you ever do this? And then he was like, oh, you act like you didn't like it. I'm like, I really don't like this, like I deleted it, I did not talk to him for such a long time until he came up to me and he apologized for it and then I started dating his friend and then we never talked about it again obviously I did not tell his friend I did not tell Tom's girlfriend who we will call June right now uh, I did not tell Tom's girlfriend June about it because I didn't know how to tell her because I also knew that Tom wasn't interested in me he knew I had a crush on him before but he I don't think that was a reason he would send it to me because he also sent the same picture to my friend or he sent a dick pic I don't know if it's the same picture I'm assuming it was the same picture I don't really know how many dick pics guys have in their phones just to send to people I'm not sure but um so he sent one to my friend Karen her actual name is Karen I'm gonna keep her name as Karen um, so he sent one to Karen and Karen was like, whoa, I did not want this. Why would you send this to me? So moral of this story of today's story time is don't send dick pics unless people ask for them because one, no one wants one. If, if we don't ask for one, we don't want one. So don't send one, bud. Like it could save you a lot of trouble if you just don't send one unless we ask for one. Thank you for watching our first official week of the Spicy Viola's channel. I hope you stay tuned for next week's video on Monday and our group videos that will be up on Saturday. So, uh, thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel for more, for more awkward story times maybe, uh, for whatever we do next week. Um, We'll be having um, Greece and Italy vlogs, me and Jeffrey, because we will be going on a group trip to Greece and Italy um, while Paula and Caitlin and Christian stay in the United States, um, and they might make group videos together. So stay tuned for those vlogs. Um, thank you for watching. Please like. It helps. Kind of. Not really. It just lets me know you you like me as a person, I guess. Um, follow all our social medias, Instagram and Twitter. Subscribe to our channel. Um, see you guys next week. Bye! <laughs>